Hello everybody, I am Austin here and today I am going to show you how to merge the subtitle file with any video file that also for permanently. So as you all can see guys this is the movie I have the Resident Evil the final chapter. So as you all can see guys this is the movie over here and this is the subtitle if you don't have the subtitle file uh, as I have yts.ag that you know that website of uh, movie so if you all need the subtitle of this file just copy this term everything and just search it on google and just write uh, the front of it their subtitle and just search there and on the first link you will get the subtitle so getting the subtitle is a very easy job so I don't think so it will be a difficult you know task to do it so as you'll have this SRT file and the video file I will be showing you how to merge them so let's start the video first for now and I will just show you that there is no subtitle for now so as I'll show you now okay So as you can see guys there are no subtitles over here the video is visible but uh, as you can see guys over here the subtitle option you can add the subtitle file manually but you know this uh, this so adding the subtitle thing will just work only once so when you will close down the video and when you will you know start the video again somewhere in the future that time you have to do the same procedure again and again which becomes a very tedious task to do so in this video I'll be showing you how to do this uh, how to merge this file into this video file and uh, as quickly as possible so let's begin so I will be giving the links in the description box below so so you all don't have to worry you know just to find the file on the internet so you all don't have to worry about that so I will just so search here like okay mkv toolkit next gui and for windows this one so let the page load okay um, and just click on this one so the link i have provided you all guys will look somewhat like this this page just click on download latest version over the right top over the over the right side and then your program will download so after your file has been downloaded it will just uh, download automatically and just you know install the file and afterward this program will install over here so just click on the program so it will open and uh, the program will look somewhat like this after it is open so the first thing which you will have to do is add source files over here on the bottom the first option over here just click on it and as you can see guys on the desktop itself uh, the file is there my resident evil so you all can select wherever your uh, video file is and just select the select both the files actually not the one file but both the files so you all can also select the files with uh, pressing control and you know just clicking on the files and also drag the mouse just select both the SRT files and the video files and just press open so as you all can see guys on the top section are the source files which I have over here my SRT file the subtitle file and on the tracks and you know this section are all my videos which I've saved with the video files so now this this section over here guys the destination file so this will be the merged file of the SRT file and the video file which will be the saved file so what we have to do is click on this small icon over here which will you know select the destination so you, you all can select the destination where you all want to you know save the file so I want to save my file on desktop itself so you know it's not a pro big problem afterwards desktop so as you can see guys my file my destination is over here my save file destination and .mkv as you can see the file source is mkv but you know as you all know on the most of the devices mp4 format is famous and it also works in most of the devices so you all can just you know type in here mp4 and just change the encoder to mp4 so it is not uh, no longer mkv but mp4 now so directly we will just uh, click here start multiplexing so just click on it and the video has started uh, you know 
merging the file the subtitle file into the video file so I will just pause down the video and then I will be back when the progress is totally 100% and I will be back guys hello everybody I'm Austin here and I'm back and as you can see guys the process is 100% and it is complete it took hardly somewhat like 1-2 minutes and it was quick as expected so our file is merged and our work is done so we'll just close this program for now and we'll go to our directory which is our desktop and as you all can see guys the merged file is over here the mp4 file I will show you all the properties so as you can see guys the file is mp4 over here we have changed if you all want the mkv then you know just keep the directory file as it is and we'll just you know play the video so I so I show so I'll show you that uh, this trick works, this method works, and also the subtitle file has merged successfully. Okay, guys, the video has started. So I will just show you. My PC is going slow, that's why it's taking time, but you know, it's okay. So as you can see guys, the uh, subtitle has, you know, come successfully. And it is appearing uh, as the video is going on, the movie is going on. As you can see. So guys, that's it for this video. I hope this tutorial helped you in some way. And if this uh, if this method helped you guys, please leave a like below and subscribe to my channel if you like my content for more upcoming videos. And I will see you guys in my next video. Until then, take care everybody.